morning guys. So we're just on our way to Weight Watchers. Um, scale say I'm due to gain about four pounds. Not ideal, but it's the consequences of enjoying yourself, isn't it? Feel a bit pants this morning, feel a bit meh. got a really busy weekend ahead of me. No, I don't know, it's just, I've obviously I've had two weekends off now where I've just relaxed and enjoyed. And it's basically just throwing myself back into the deep end. And I haven't like, oh, basically, I've got a social tomorrow evening in Cardiff. my modelling and then I'm working on Saturday morning <coughs> well I'm working on Saturday so I'm up really early 5.45 to get to work on Saturday and then on Sunday I've got a photo shoot all day starting from 8 o'clock in the morning so going to be a long one and it's probably going to be like a shock to the system but it also doesn't allow me to see somebody that I want to see because our uh, like paths have crossed um, basically because I booked all these things in before which is a bit annoying because I don't want things to become too disjointed. <laughs> so I think I'm just going to stick the radio on now and hope that music lifts my mood because I feel pants really, which is annoying. just leaving town now um, I gained another three pounds which is ridiculous because now that's six pounds gained in two weeks but it's been my birthday and all the rest of the excuses that I could tell you that I'm gonna spare you from so I'm annoyed in some ways and then in other ways I can accept what I've done so it depends which way I want to look at it all I know now is this week I'm gonna be so good. I've got no socialising that, that revolves around food so that's always a good thing. It's always hard to keep weight loss in control when you're eating out all the time so no more eating out. I don't think I'm gonna plan to eat out until next month hopefully so yes onwards soldier on. We have definitely evolved over the years as Essex women. We can all take a laugh and a joke at ourselves, Kay, you know, we're up for the banter. But it is very, very derogatory what has been said about us and it does need to be changed. But during this, during this interview we did find out something about Gemma which I didn't know. I'm a massive fan of the dictionary. You know, we should be like promoting the dictionary anyway because like it is such an amazing like historical british thing isn't it oh i love this i forgot about it i'm a massive fan of the dictionary and now Gemma's final thought i wanted to come because personally i think the dictionary should be um, paying everyone in a system compensation i'm a massive
massive fan of the dictionary. I'm a 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 massive fan of the dictionary. Don't act like you know me, like you know me, na na eh. I am not your homie, not your homie, na na eh. Don't act like you know me, like you know me, nah, nah, eh. You don't know me. I mean, we can throw shapes together. But it doesn't mean you're in my circle. Yeah. Do you wanna drink? No, thanks for asking. Don't act like you know me, like you know me, nah, nah, eh. I am not your homie, not your homie, nah, nah, eh. Don't act like you know me, like you know me, nah, nah, eh. I am not your homie, not your homie, nah, nah, eh. You don't know me. I got that fire in my soul. Evening guys, um, so I'm, this is going to be like my last entry so I thought I'd come to you with a bit more positivity than you've seen in the previous clips. I am feeling a little bit brighter now. So I received some um, belated uh, birthday presents from my best friend Eleanor. So um, let's just give you a background history about Eleanor. I don't talk about her much because she lives in Yorkshire but she's part of the same friendship circle as Chloe, Louisa, Corinne and all that lot. So um, she's like the ultimate bae. So um, yeah, I picked up some gifts. Um, her, she'd given them to her mum on the weekend and her mum had brought them back down to Swansea. So I went around there earlier and picked them up. So I'm going to show you what I got in the order um, that I opened them. Um, so one was a cup shaped so I was, I'm assuming, I assumed naturally that it was a mug and it is this and it says unicorns are awesome. I am awesome therefore I am a unicorn. <laughs> I love it. Um, I went through a stage, it, it didn't last very long, I think it started before I started daily vlogging um, like I was obsessed with unicorns and it's kind of stuck in a way I haven't like actively gone out and bought anything myself um, but I think people remembered it um, because Louisa bought me a unicorn related uh, Christmas present as well and Alna always like tags me in like unicorn things on Facebook and it's yeah it is they are really cute so she got me that and then a pair of socks well two pairs of socks so these are pink and they've got unicorns on them <laughs> and then the other pair um, I've got at the moment uh, with some rainbows on them which is just awesome so I put them on this evening which makes a change because I normally wear Christmas socks all year round because um, they're what my mum bought me so um, it makes a nice change to have something a little bit brighter, but they're still like novelty socks. And then the last thing that I opened um, is this light box. Now I've wanted one of these for ages and ages and never really got around to buying one for one reason or another. But now I've got one. I just need to get some batteries for it, but it's absolutely awesome. So I've set it up um, for my channel already which is cool so I'm absolutely loving that that's going to be good for like my formal videos etc so it's wicked I want I feel like there's not enough letters I wanted to write hashtag uh, girl did good but there wasn't enough letters to create it so I feel like I need to ask her where she got this from so I can buy another one just so I can have the spare letters or if any of you guys know where I can get spare letters from to fit this, then that would also be awesome as well. So, yeah, absolutely loving that. Oh, I made it upside down. Because you can hang it on the wall, but the hanging things are there. So I've done it upside down, really. But it's typical. Blonde by name, blonde by nature. So that's that. So I feel like... The balance of the universe has been restored by unicorns and ber belated birthday presents because I do feel a little more chirpier than I did earlier, well, at the beginning of my vlog. So despite the weight gain, 
um, we're doing okay. So I've had, today I've been 100% on plan. I've actually got seven points left for the day. Um, I don't really feel hungry or anything and I'm going to head to bed soonish. It's, what's the time now? It is two minutes past nine. So come 10 o'clock, I think I'm gonna get into bed, which is super early for me because I normally head to bed about midnight and beyond. I usually fall asleep on the sofa um, and stuff like that, but I'm gonna just edit this now and then head to bed. Even if I lie there for like two hours, it's better than going to bed at midnight and then lying there for another two hours. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm gonna try and just rest and chill and um, I shall see you all tomorrow. Bye.